In this video, we are going to discuss a previous grade problem related to system response. You can observe this problem. A system with zero initial conditions has the closed loop transfer function T of S is equal to S square plus 4 by S plus 1 into S plus 4. The system output is zero at the frequency. We need to find out the frequency at which frequency the system output is zero they are asking they given transfer function of the closed loop control system so here they given options like 0.5 radians per second so 1 radian per second 2 radian per second 4 radians per second like this they given an answer so here we need to find out at which frequency the system output is zero first of all this is very simple problem when you know what is meant by what we need to take it as system output so in magnitude of transfer function we can take it as system output so here for control system the magnitude at which some frequency is equivalent to zero means system output is zero so here modulus of t of s at omega unknown omega is equivalent to zero we need to find out this omega so modulus of t of s i am considering so s square plus 4 by s plus 1 into s plus 4 is equivalent to 0. Now as I told you when we are doing any analysis better to convert into when they are asking frequency especially better to convert into omega domain. So that is why I am converting into omega. So j omega whole square plus 4. So this one in place of s substitute j omega that is it. So, j omega whole square plus 4 divided by j omega plus 1 and j omega plus 4 is equal to 0. So, modulus. So, here modulus of a numerator you are having 4 minus omega square in denominator j omega plus 1 and j omega plus 4. So, now you can see the numerator. Numerator is real value. So, only denominator we can apply modulus. So, here 4 minus omega square is equal to root of omega square plus 1 into root of omega square plus 4 square is equal to 0. So, if you equate this to 0 then 4 minus denominator goes to this side and it will become 0. 4 minus omega square is equal to 0. 4 is equal to omega square, omega is equal to root 4, omega is equal to 2 radians per second. So, this is angular frequency that is why radians per second. So, here the option is option C. So, like this way we need to solve. Only thing you need to know is output means whenever for example for particular input if they are asking they are just asking whenever system output is zero they are not giving any input or anything just we are having transfer function of the system they are asking at which frequency output of the system system output is zero so then in that case we can find like this system output means magnitude will get at output so if magnitude is zero we are not getting system output definitely we need to get some magnitude if you are getting output when magnitude is zero means definitely system output is zero so that's why that is the reason i take in like this so i got 2 radians per second just consider modulus to get magnitude so modulus of that transfer function is magnitude so after taking modulus i am just replaced as to omega why because we need to find out frequency so that is why i consider j omega in place of s after calculation i got omega is equal to 2 radians per second like this way we can solve this type of problems very easily by knowing simple points.